And finally, the market town of Ulverston in Cumbria is celebrating its connection to a cinematic legend today. Film buffs will know that Stan Rowell, half of the classic comedy duo Laurel and Hardy, was born there. And fans from around the world have been working for 17 years to honour the town's favourite son. Tom Barton reports. Arguably the greatest comedy double act of all time, Stan Laurel and Ollie Hardy were pioneers of physical comedy on the big screen. And today the pair who achieved worldwide success were immortalised in Stan Laurel's birthplace, the small town of Ulverston, Cumbria. A bronze statue for the stars of the silver screen. And they actually look like Lot on the Hardy, don't they? A lot of statues don't always look like the person, but this, you can actually see Stan and uh, Ollie's expression. So, this is another fine mess you've got me into. Excuse me, please, my ear is full of milk. Laurel and Hardy starred together in more than 100 silent movies and talkies in a career spanning 31 years. They visited Ulverston's Coronation Hall in 1947. This rare footage belonged to councillor Henry Simpson, the man who invited them to the homecoming celebrations. And it's outside Coronation Hall that the statue now proudly stands, a fitting tribute to a pair who helped change comedy. Tom Barton, ITV News. Now, there's been no shortage of great comedians from this region and we have some fine statues in tribute to some of the best. Morecambe has Eric and St Anne's has Les Dawson. Well, today it was the turn of Ulverston to get its Stan. Stan Laurel was born in the Cumbrian town nearly 120 years ago. Liverpool funny man Ken Dodd was on hand for the unveiling ceremony today, as was our reporter Mark Tattersall. Welcome, Mr. Ken Dodd and the Mayor of Ulverston for the official unveiling ceremony. Well, it's been nearly 120 years since Stan Laurel was born here. 17 years of fundraising and petitioning, five years in storage, three weeks under wraps. But today, Ulverston finally got its statue of its most famous son. Unveiled by Ken Dodd, it's designed to be a lasting tribute to a comedy legend. It's a great honour, great privilege to have been asked to unveil the statues because they, and they actually look like Lot on the Hardy, don't they? A lot of statues don't always look like the person, but this, you can actually see Stan and uh, Ollie's expression. So, this is another fine mess you've got me into. Wow, what a great place for everybody to meet, right by the statue underneath the light. Yeah, me too. What do you mean, you too? Mm -mm. <laughs> I've got great affection for these guys. Um, and the part of my childhood, and most of the world's childhood, and it still made me laugh. Well, this statue takes pride of place in Ulverston, a pride matched by the town, as they honour Stan Laurel, their most famous export. 